Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Elden Ring on Playframe. We're going to start today by fighting a big tree worm. And hopefully beating it? Hard to say. Uh, so I tried thinking about loadout a little bit, and I don't have any great ideas, if I'm honest. I'm going to try out the halberd to see if holy damage does anything more noticeably better. Uh, I have the benefit of being able to get, like, an attack and defense buff with this thing, but I do lose the blood slash, which was doing some pretty good damage to the thing. I couldn't really tell if fire was doing anything all that much better, and it seems to breathe a kind of fire. I don't know if that was magic, technically. It was yellow. I don't know if that counts as fire or magic or fire magic or some other combo blend <laughs> that this game seems to do. But with this, like, I got my rune arc on, I can get Aurelia out for a little bit of distraction and probably can't poison it, but uh, I can get my regen buff. I can get this. And once we get in there, we can get Aurelia. And then we'll see what happens. If I have enough uh, FP left. Hope I do. Quick. It seems like Holy could do something pretty good against a, such a corrupted looking thing. Can I, can I have a turn? Hey, may I have a turn? Tree spirit. Mm, yeah, I can't really tell what that's doing by comparison damage wise, but uh, you're right there, Aurelia. So you can breathe a lot. The thing that got me last time was a big explosion type thing, which is scary. The big hits are doing all right. I can block a lot of stuff, but not getting eaten and not getting exploded. Those are two hard things to block for me. Look out. I don't know what's coming, but I don't like it. Explosion? Yep. Ow! It's just a one-two explosion. Boy. And then it's charged up with something? Oh, boy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it really is gone. Okay. No more distractions. What a big, angry nightmare. Interesting that this is so close to where we, like, start the game. Ooh. Yes. There we go. A golden seed from it, too. Wow. And a banished knight Oleg. Awesome. Okay. So, like... I'm just trying to think, because, like, this seems like a catacomb very similar to the ones I've been finding out in the wild, many of which, somewhere at their base, have a whole bunch of tree roots where the dead are just sort of, like, getting melded up into it and returning to the tree. And that's kind of happening here, too. But the fact that there was a big ulcerated tree spirit, like, a corrupted type thing here going absolutely wild and frenzied seems bad. Seems like that's not how it's supposed to work. Uh, and it seems also interesting that this is near where we, like, yeah, we start the game out in that little isolated tiny area, but then when we reawaken, we awaken here. And I wonder if us awakening here and the ulcerated tree spirit being here have some significance. Maybe not. Uh, that new summon, though. Oleg. Here we go. Uh, the Banished Knight. One of the two knights known as the Wings of the Storm. After his banishment, he attracted the notice of the grace-given lord, and later, having slain a hundred traitors as the lord's hand, Oleg earned the hero's honor of Erdtree Burial. Huh. That is interesting. So we've got Oleg and Ingval, the two banished knights. I wish I could remember where we got the Ingval one. 
<laughs> Much I don't understand, but feels pretty good having won that. The Fringe Folk Hero's Grave. Hmm. So, all right, let's rest here. Because that's quite a lot of runes to have just gotten. Uh, can't afford a level yet, though. Um, so... Let's check that off. I can also check that off. And I guess we're kind of... I could check in on Kenneth, but I can't imagine what's changed. I, we've got another great rune. I should go check on Kenneth. Uh... Still haven't the foggiest what to do with this. And I can go back into Castle Stormvale. I am starting to think maybe I'll just kind of save that for later. I know there's definitely stuff in there that I have missed. Uh, but I'm really excited to see more stuff now. <laughs> and it's already been two episodes of attempted backtracking and lots of other wild stuff happening along the way. Uh, Y'all, if there's anything super cool back in Stormvale that I need to go see, by all means, let me know, because I'll go there. But uh, I think maybe I'll just check in on a NPC or two around here, and then let's get back down into Shifra, because uh, that's exciting. Yeah, all right. Uh, Kenneth, are you still here? I do still... I need three golden seeds now to get another flask, yeah? I'll double check that. I thought I got to the point where I needed three now. Get out of here, little guys. I'm here to talk to Kenneth. Please. Kenneth. Only Kenneth. Kenneth, you still here? Moping. I must begin my search. Yep, that's the same. Okay. Pardon me. Sorry. Get out of here. Shoo. Okay. All right. Yeah, here. Let's go back here and uh, just see if I could upgrade the flask or get a new charge of it. Because that would be pretty sweet if I could. Uh, yep. Yeah, need three. I've only got the two. Oh, well. I don't think I have another sacred tier. Nope. All right. Had to check. All right. In that case, what was the other thing I was going to go do? It was something. Maybe it wasn't anything. Maybe I did all the things. I think I might have done all the things. Well, all the things I know about or know what to do about. Yeah. All right. Let's just go to Chifra. We're really close to it. Actually, we can just warp down there. That'll be... Faster, won't it? Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited to see more of this place. It was also pretty. I know we got a little further in. I'm just kind of... Uh, starting a bit further back, just... In case there was anything cool I missed, because I was kind of in a panicked rush last time I was here. It was a while ago. Uh... Like, here's a shiny. See? We could have missed that. By the way, thank you again to everyone who has been so darn good about not, like, saying spoilers and stuff in the comments. Y'all have all generally, for the most part, been very good. There have been a few folks who have been a little bit, uh, getting a little bit lax with it. <laughs> and I would encourage them to hold fast as best you can. But, uh, on the whole, y'all have all been great, and I really appreciate it. It's been a delight being surprised by... ...all the wild nonsense in this game. Oh, hello everyone. Didn't know this was the hangout. Ah, now I can two-shot you, though. That's... Ah, that's nice. That's just nice. Yeah, last time I went through this little fort structure... And I think I grabbed everything interesting, though. 
from this specific place. Whoop. Well, don't really need a heal refresh right now. Yeah, I climbed up up there, got some cool stuff, a spell I still have no use for, but that's how it goes. Yeah, all right. Let's progress further. Unless... Hang on. There's a bunch of these dudes parked down here, and... That's fine, but, uh, also silver fireflies. This doesn't open, does it? Probably not, but... Couldn't hurt to check after we tidy up. So many of them. Clear out, people. And... Uh, nah. Ooh, so my health is a little bit lowered right now. Let's swap back to the Royal Remains gear a little bit and see if it does that regen thing. Does it? Can't really tell if it's doing that. I feel like I've misunderstood something about how this armor works. Ah, well. So... <laughs> better call the elevator. Well, since I don't seem to be regenning, I guess I'll... get the fashion going again. There we are. And we'll ride the pretty elevator. I do love how pretty the elevators are here. And most of the other things. Yes. Yes. Prettiness. Pretty sure I poked my head over here before. Yeah, like there was just this little room here. And... There must have been a shiny or something in here before. Yeah. Otherwise, that's just a very little empty room. <laughs> So, let's see. There was a big crab up around here. And then we got a little further in and the place kind of opened up. Crab, not now. Hey, have any of y'all seen Blythe? Friendly wolf guy? I'm looking for Blythe. And the Nokron city. Actually, I found that just by a different route. And there's not a lot there to, like, do from that side. So, I think I need to find it from a different side. I'm looking for a lot of things. Uh... Eh, let's go ahead and rest up. Alright. Time to be a bit more thorough. There we go. So there's those little sprites, which were fairly aggressive last time, if I recall. Uh, oh. Didn't see that option before. Cool. Um, neat. Uh. Love having the deer down here. This little place... Was that lit earlier? This little place had what looks like an arena. And I still feel like it's going to be, but... I just feel like... That thing's gonna wake up eventually. It just feels that way, doesn't it?
I'm wondering now if me lighting that fire lit this. I couldn't remember if it was lit before. Let's see if we can find another fire to light. Uh, is this one? This might be one. Uh, this is not one. Oh, more crabs. Excuse me. Oh yeah, it's this little path up here too as an option. Uh, and there were some of those, yeah, more of these ancestral warrior spirits who are interesting. How much damage am I doing to these, these days? Better than before. Better than before. Oop, what was that? Thought something was casting a spell at me or something. Uh, all right. Oh, you saw me. How's this going to go? Better. Much better. Much better. Ow. There we go. Oh, yes. I feel so much more equipped for this. Okay. Yeah, almost didn't see you there. Really snuck up. Love how many animals there are just hanging out down here. It's really cool. So, light. Cool. Now, are there two lit things down there? It looks like yes. Okay. So I'm guessing that's an objective I have to do now, and as soon as I finish lighting it, then the boss will try to kill me as my reward. Hey. Oh. Ow. Okay. <laughs> just kind of disappeared on me. I wonder, does that... Huh. Are those just like traps that if I set them off and then run and then avoid dying, ideally, will they then disappear? Let's try to get our runes and test this. So, hey, thing. Attack. I'll run. And then... Gone. Okay, nice. That's good to know. All right. Oh. Hey, one of these. Hmm. Where will this take me? Or will it? All right, sure. Uh, what? Wait, where are we? Where are we? Oh, wait, we're just. It's the same area. We're just like a little further. <laughs> okay. Uh. Sure. All right. Um, I'm going to go back. <laughs> At this point, I was just kind of expecting it to send me off who knows where. Not just be an actually convenient means of slightly faster travel. <laughs> All right. Yep. Avoid the sprites and their little traps. So let's see. There were more warriors out here. Yes. We're not as terrifying as they used to be, and that's great. Although they are still snipers. Yep, still snipers. Real good with the bows. Hmm. Let's explore. I got more fires I need to light, seems like. Oh, maybe the uh, warp thing took me, like, up there, someplace I can't actually reach from here. 
let's see. Let's see how much I can actually access coming just on foot around here. And then, uh, maybe we'll need to go back and use the warp to explore further. Ow. Thanks for the arrows. What a cool place. Oh. Hmm. That is tempting. That is tempting, isn't it? Oh. Hello. Can I, uh... Oh, I can't target you. Are we cool? Oh, it's Blythe. Hi, bud. I didn't recognize you. Sorry. Ah. Good to see you. Apologies, mate. But I don't have much to report. I can see bloody Nokron right above me. But I'm absolutely stumped. I've tried all the gateways, to no avail. Perhaps it's time to ask Celebus. I recall that spiteful little rat acting like he knew something. Let's give him a squeeze. Show him just how sharp my teeth are. Hey, I'm all for it. Uh, but I'll look around too and see if I can help you out. I jest. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. Besides, uh, I should check on some things here. Leave this place to me. You just do what you feel is right. Kill Salavis, got it. If us learns anything, we tell the other. Right? Sounds like a plan. Okay. Yipes, careful. Uh... I don't even know if you're able to do these jumps, buddy. That may explain why you've not been able to uh, get places. Let me try. Although he has shown a knack for getting up to very high places, so maybe this has not been a challenge for him. Eugh. Okay. Careful with the jumps. Whee! Don't know where I'm going. Hey, nice! I'll take that. Uh, but yeah, to get out there, I need to use my little uh, warp to fight that dude again. Alright, so yeah, this all up above us is Necron. We just need to figure out how to get there. So cool. Can I get back? This feels not the safest. Uh, well, that's something. Careful, careful. This might work. Huh? Yay! It's going to work. All right. Whew. Well. Uh, let's see. That jump shouldn't be a problem, but... Get ourselves a little running start, just in case. We were fine. All right. Whew. Well, that wasn't it, buddy, but I'll keep looking. Um. Yeah, there's animals everywhere. It's cool. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Animals clear out. It's about to get violent here, okay? Thank you. There we go. Oh. Hey. There we go. Yes. All right. 
Not far from another level. That's exciting. Pardon me, animals. Hey, guys. No sniping. I've had so much sniping from your kind already. I really don't... I don't need more. I'm full. Thanks. Of arrows. I've been shot by enough of your arrows from long range to last a lifetime. Or end one. There's three. It seemed like there were like six to eight of those fires back there. I guess we got a lot of work to do. Yeah. Yeah, we've gone from being. Whoop. Nope. Ow. Boy, that still hurts. Stop. Yeah, we've gone from being... a little under-leveled for this place to being a little over-leveled, I think. And that is fine with me. Eh. Nice. Alright, well, let's see where this goes. I guess the smarter thing to do would be explore everything I can find here in this little patch, then try warps. Because, yeah, where am I? I guess a little higher up a cliff, maybe? I just warped from, like, what, here? Hmm. Oh, and now I can't warp back. Okay, well, that's fine. I'm here now. Kind of empty up here. Not sure where all the enemies went. Although I do feel like I see something pretty big over there. <laughs> I might be wrong. Seems big. Uh. Hmm. Whoa. A lot of these guys in here. Dangerous little room. Careful. Are you... a spell? You might be a spell. Hey, hold still. Hold still. Are you a spell? You are! Great oracular bubble. Cool. Also, smithing stones. Love those. Thanks. Good. Careful. Heard them carefully. Oh boy, we got magic coming in. Careful there. Yeah. Slow and steady. Yikes. Slower and steadier if need be. Oh, we are totally getting a level after this. Yeah. And last one. Yeah. Woo. Hooray. All right. There's... A little beetle thing, but just a health one, I think. A lot more dudes with spears. A lot more. Shiny. Sure. Hmm. What do we got back here? Anything? What? Hang on. Okay, there we go. I was about to say. You can't have that not work. Oh, cool. Alright. A few of those.
It's so eerily quiet. And quietly eerie. And it's just pretty as heck. Man, the views. Uh. Okay. I do want to see what this big thing is. Probably at my peril, yeah, especially given that thing's here. Ugh. Can I find a grace fire, please? Because I can't tell for sure what that is. Yeah. I'm gonna go looking for another grace fire first. Or I guess I could warp back. That would also work. I might do that, actually. Hmm. Huh. Yeah, warp back, explore that first area more thoroughly till I'm sure I've covered everything I can spot down there, and then... Yeah, that might be something, actually. Although, I guess I might be running out of space in this area to do as well. Hmm. Well, here. This is just... This is so many runes. Let's go back. Spend them, and then keep this exploration party going. So, eh, we'll keep this going. Maybe up to 30. Yeah, 30 will be a good spot for it to live for a little bit. All right, so we need to find eight total. We found three, it looks like. Did I look up this way? I don't know if I did. Uh, well, didn't see these guys before, so hey, hi. Sorry to interrupt. I'm looking for things to set on fire. Have you seen any? Uh... Ooh. I knew they'd hide something up here. Hey, inverted hawk heater shield. It's kind of cool. What is this? Uh, the inverted hawk is the emblem of the company of slaves ordered to explore the Eternal City. Huh. Who's slaves, though? Would this be a Godric group or a... Like, Golden Order type group? I don't even know if Golden Order is the right term. There have been a lot of proper nouns getting thrown around that seem... Like, I'm becoming less and less sure that I know what the greater will is. Because it keeps getting used in sentences in ways that... don't quite align with what I thought. Or expected. Kind of the same with Golden Order, too, actually. There's a thing that, like a throwaway line that Roderica says, or it seemed throwaway at the time, with Roderica mentioning that she understands now why, like, immortal essence takes the form of spirits under the Golden Order. And that, that's like a lot of stuff in one sentence, but it almost makes the Golden Order seem like a force in this world, not like a literal... I thought it just meant, like, the, the Golden Order might have something to do with, like, it's just the, uh... If you were part of the Golden Order, you were allied with, like, the... This family of demigods and the... Godwin and all these others, but... I don't know, that sentence from Roderica makes it sound like something quite different. I am interested. Yellow. Okay. We went up that way, we lit that one. Uh, there's a lot more here, though. And I thought I saw a glimpse of... some little lit up pathway back here a little bit. Maybe... Eh, maybe not. 
I thought this was something. It is not something. There's a guy, though. Hi. Oop, hang on. Collect. There we go. And... Uh, nope, we're fine. Uh, yeah, I went up that way and lit something on fire, I think. Yeah. I know I went up that way. I see some jumping platforms up ahead. Land octopus, everyone's favorite. Okay. Just trying to steal your stuff, chill out. So many animals. Ooh, this is interesting. Yeah, there's so much life down here. Yeah. No. Well, let's take care of you. I don't want to get hit by magic everywhere, please. Ah. Die, please. That's a sturdy thing. There we go. Thank you, plants. Yes, I'm poisoned already. You've done your work. That's enough. And now this is a very good excuse to try out a spell I've been meaning to see about. Uh, maybe I should heal first, just in case. I don't know how much this is going to hurt. But, um... Fire, cleanse me! Oh, that only did a little damage. I like it. Hehehe. <laughs> Good spell. Oh, shining up there. Okay. How will I reach that? Hmm. Excuse me. Excuse me. Maybe by getting into this stuff. Whatever this stuff is. Hello? Is anyone actually here? What are these structures? I wonder if, like, whoever came down here to explore, like, built some fortifications. Um, okay. You do you. I'm just going to keep climbing. Do you also want to jump off the ledge? You may if you wish. All right, fine. Boop. I wonder, are these all Albinorix who I'm finding here dead like this, or are these... These may just be sort of like regular sorcerer corpses, maybe. It's it's hard to tell what faction a lot of these dead are from. But they seem to be the same sort who are sitting out in chairs in the middle of nowhere looking out to sea a lot of the time. Uh, hello? Hello? Huh. Uh, okay, just making sure I didn't miss anything back there. Charge! Oh. Not at all what I expected. Hi. Ooh, oh. 
A customer. Yeah, I bet you don't get a lot of business out here, huh? You got soap. You got nascent butterflies. You got one, some of these. Yeah, and they're pretty cheap, too. I will buy them. One of those. Uh, cookbooks. Two of them. This one does soap and oil pots. And dappled cured meat. And dappled white cured meat, huh? Well, I know I want these. I'm getting them all. And now I'm poor. I might get your other stuff later. Goodbye. Goodbye. Till next time. Yes. Thank you for all the keys. It's good to have some more of those in stock. Boy. The places you run into those fellas. Okay, so like... Hmm. I'm not yet seeing another thing to set on fire. But there's still a little more that I can explore out this way. Hello. Sorry. I feel like I'm interrupting. But you guys are just so aggressive once you see me. Yeah, there's a lot of area out here. Hey, ah, that's nice. I will take that. Also touch this before I forget. I bet I've missed so many of those. Just forgotten to interact with them. So where are we now? We're like, okay, we're out here abouts. And I want to say when we got warped out here, it actually did warp me somewhere close-ish to here. Hmm. Big place. Is this... Whoop, okay, look out, 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 take cover, take cover, take cover. Oof. Okay. Those are effective traps. But here's a thing to set on fire. Awesome. Good. I've lost count of how many that is. It's at least four. Maybe as many as six. But probably just five. It's actually probably just four. I don't remember. Let's keep pushing out this way. I got a good feeling. Eh. Missed. Kind of glad I'm a little overpowered for here right now, honestly. Y'all are, uh... Plentiful. This would be a heck of a place to have to try to get through. Huh, y'all are doing the... Stompy dance thing. I suspect... It's a big wide open area. I'm in trouble. But I also see this, so... No, don't go off the cliff, don't go off the cliff. Or do and die, which, like, take a break. One of the two. What is it? Ooh, square off. Cool. There's a, okay. That's this is what I warped to. This is the thing that uh, it warped me to. I think. This feels about right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. There's a fire thing. I see a fire thing. Yeah. What are y'all stomping to out here? It seemed like an act of reverence, and it seems like the rats are along with you in that, which is interesting. Rat, please. Not during the stompy dance. Can't you see they're stomping? They were doing that toward one of the minor Erd trees in other places. And if they're going to be cool, then I will be cool. Hey, rats. 
Not right now, okay? Nope. No sniping. I can tell. You were going to snipe. Don't act like you weren't going to snipe. Yeah. Rats, come on. Don't you have anything better to do? Rats. Boy, hard to hit. There we go. I'm kind of seeing a little path over there, aren't I? Rats, come on. Hang on. Hang on. I'm seeing something over this way. More guys stomping. Big rat, but also... Hey. This looks promising. Yes. This looks like something I want. Yes. Yes. That's three. Awesome. Hmm. Anything else out here across the bridge? Hmm. There's something. Hey. What do we got here? Sure. Hmm. Maybe this is all there is out here, but... Hmm. Whew. Long way down. What's out all the way over here, though? That's interesting. That looks very similar to the elevator I've taken in other places. Like the, like the elevator, like the building I went into to uh, ride down here in the first place. Where, if that is another elevator, like where would that take me? I must know. There's a thing I didn't light on fire. I'm shirking my... fire setting responsibilities. Oh. One left. Rat, come on. Stop playing follow the leader. Alright, you guys don't mind me, okay? I'm just... starting fire, that's all. Yeah, we're cool. Right? Yes. Okay, cool. And now I leave. Bye. I wonder what happens when I light all the fires and then probably get attacked. But if I do, and then I win, what happened? And what's this? Clarifying Horn Charm. Huh. Okay. Uh, gotta see what that is. An accoutrement worn by the Ancestral Followers raises focus. Said to be a budding horn. They, uh, ancestral Followers believe that the horns of a long-lived beast continue to bud like antlers. Okay, so the same sort of thing. I basically got the modeled necklace, which is the combo of all three, which does seem really good. Like, immunity, robustness, and focus all in one. Seems pretty good. And this is an elevator that will take 
two keys, but I have keys now. And I am curious. So here we go. Eh. Well, here we go in a second. Yeah, I kind of figured. All right. Use key. And... Where go? Oh. Uppies. But to where? We're going very fast. Like, real fast. Very up. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Maybe this is not where I want it to be. Well, I mean, we can get this at least, right? That's not so bad. Where are we? Oh. All right. Well, that's not so far. The deep shuffer well. All right, cool. Not too far away from <laughs> the last place, or I guess the first place we got stuck in out here. But I don't want to be here. Nice having that little connection, though. Love it. I am leaving. Bye. There have got to be some people who missed the first Shifra well for whom this was the first one they found. Yeah, like there's got to be. But I guess the elevator wouldn't work for them, so... Huh. Yeah, even if it was the first one they found, I guess it wouldn't do them any good. So cool. All right. Well, now I feel like we've covered a lot. Uh, I feel like there must have been more to do across that bridge. Let me look just real quick. Make sure there wasn't like a uh, whoops. It's fine. Just make sure there wasn't one a grace fire like right here. Don't want to just miss that, do we? No, no, we don't. But then, let's, let me go across that little bridge again and just make sure there wasn't something else important just right over there that I missed. Excuse me, fellas, please don't snipe. Just, please don't. I have important things to check out. Ah! I explicitly asked. So yeah, I wandered off this way, but was there more here? I think there is. Okay. Might not be more here I can do much with, but... Nope. All right. So, okay. I think to get up here, or, well, to get up at all, we need to warp back up to the spot. And we roughly know where to do that. So before we... Uh, start wrapping up today. Let's go back here, because I want to see how many of these I've lit. That is seven. Okay, we're missing one. Just one. And I bet... Well, hang on. We've... We've better... Ow. Okay, no, this isn't... This isn't anything. Uh... Where was that warp station that took me up top? Maybe it's up there. Maybe. Sneak through here, go up top. Whoop. Get the shiny I almost missed. There we go. Uh, ah, okay, yes, you again. I remember. Stop. It's so uncool. 
I mean, it would be cool if I did it, but when you guys do it all the time, less cool. Is that a fire spot down there that I've not lit? I'm actually starting to think it might be. Ooh, that might be a little steep. Wait, I thought I got you. Stop. Hang on. I could have sworn that was a fire thing that I'd not lit. Yep. Yeah, it is. All right, then. Well, I know what we're doing before we wrap up today. Oh, didn't see what that said. It said something somewhere. Sorry, I was just trying to mount up. <laughs> the instant it popped up, so I hit triangle. Uh, okay, can I warp? Good, let's go. Because I must see. I just must see. What is going to happen now? Death is certain. But spectacle is likely. And that's worth it. Ah? You're glowing. Oh, yep. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, yep, yep. So... I feel like we weren't properly introduced last time. How's it going? Are we cool? Like, are we? Um. What? What? And here I thought we were going to be cool. Well, um, I have not the foggiest idea what to expect now, so sword and, and the rest of this is fine, probably. Uh, let's have a little of that. And uh, let's see. That's cool. Ancestor spirit. Can I mount up in here? No. It just seemed like such a big place. But all right. So. Whoa. Okay. Oh boy. <laughs> wow. No. Get out of that. Quick. Yeah, I'm kind of mean to be using my shield right now. Not this. Shield? Okay, well that went terribly. <laughs> but it's so cool though. Alright. First thing tomorrow, we are fighting that thing. And not dying quite so stupidly. Just regular like. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow for spirit moose fights. <laughs> Until then, take care, and goodbye.